but Nicole Bobic could change all that. It's open for her. She has a chance to win the title here, and what scalp she'll have if she could beat Michelle Kwan and Saria Bonnelly. She won American Nationals, beating Kwan there. Let's see what she can do here. 17 years old, originally from Chicago, now out of L.A., and very much a Hollywood star in the making, Nicole Bobek. Music from Dr. Shivago. Starts with the Lutz. And gets it. And goes for a triple toe at the end, which would have been amazing, but it was double footed. That's right, she just stepped off the end of that, but uh, she does. One of the fastest triple lutzes that I've ever seen from any lady. However, she does uh, change edge on the entry. So technically, it should be marked as a flip. Well, there was a flip and uh, just couldn't hold it. She tends to take that one round the corner an awful long way. And uh, I think on that occasion, dropped the right hip a little bit on the takeoff and paid the price. Now she's to win this, she can afford no more mistakes. Just held on on the triple toe. on the spin. Only a double loop. Aiming for a triple. to be a triple Salco. on the double axle. Oh dear. Nicole is not impressed with that at all. Wonderful choreography. Superb artistic interpretation. But technically, it wasn't there. And you go on about timing, and it was all about timing there. Yes, there was uh, no timing at all there today. She does have the tendency to swing her jumps a little bit. And uh, when she's on song, she gets away with it. But uh, 
today that wasn't the case here's that look see that change of edge going in the left foot should stay on the outside but uh, she changes onto the inner but great determination and uh, this is a, a pretty strange shape ice rink you can see there where the ice machine has been un unable to go into the corners mm -hmm. and uh, she'll be very grateful for that fact because she'd never have got the triple toe in here we see the attempt at the flip now what she spots very wide and uh, that gives her a little bit of swing and uh, you can see the right hip too low on the landing couldn't cope with the lean too many mistakes i'm afraid and uh, nicole bobeck is going to be lucky to get on the podium and uh, it's beginning to sink in it's been an amazing year for her you probably all know about the uh, instant in the uh, room of a friend of hers where she uh, was found intruding and uh, had to have community service but she's come back from it well did so well in the world to get a bronze medal but uh, Richard Callahan knows he can't really enthuse her about that performance and uh, it's a rather depressing end to the year for Nicole but she'll be back next year and she's done really well when it really mattered 5-5 five, five up to 5-7 not good enough I'm afraid to put her on the podium and there's confirmation Karen Kadeva you didn't see but um, I can tell you wasn't very impressive Nicole Bobek fourth Olga Markova doing really well a better free program from her third place Saria Bonnelly second seems to be runner up too many times we're unlucky apart from Europeans of course and uh, Michelle Kwan just does enough to hold on the men's event was a lot better than the ladies on this particular day it certainly was but uh, what a star for the future and uh, remember that name Michelle Kwan so we've got more figure skating next week Chris we're back to bring you the championship from Morzine and of course next year we'll be back with all that's best in figure skating through the 95 96 season Hope you've enjoyed our coverage so far, and you'll stay with us. From Chris Howarth and myself, Simon Reid, thanks for joining us. See you next time.